There are some tarot cards that are often associated with specific astrological signs due to their symbolic meanings and correspondences. Here are some examples. The magician card is often associated with the sign of Mercury, which rules communication and intellect. The high priestess card is often associated with the sign of the moon, which rules intuition and emotions. The empress card is often associated with the sign of Venus, which rules love and beauty. The emperor card is often associated with the sign of Aries, which rules leadership and assertiveness. The hierophant card is often associated with the sign of Taurus, which rules stability and tradition. The lover's card is often associated with the sign of Gemini, which rules duality and communication. The chariot card is often associated with the sign of Cancer, which rules emotions and the home. The strength card is often associated with the sign of Leo, which rules courage and power. The hermit card is often associated with the sign of Virgo, which rules introspection and analysis. The justice card is often associated with the sign of Libra, which rules balance and fairness. The death card is often associated with the sign of Scorpio, which rules transformation and rebirth. The temperance card is often associated with the sign of Sagittarius, which rules balance and expansion. The devil card is often associated with the sign of Capricorn, which rules control and discipline. The star card is often associated with the sign of Aquarius, which rules hope and progress. The moon card is often associated with the sign of Pisces, which rules intuition and dreams. It is important to note that these associations can vary depending on the interpretation and context of the reading, and there is no one right way to interpret tarot cards.